Daddy Long Legs is based on the novel Daddy Long Legs by Jean Webster. It centers on Jerusha Abbott, who is an orphan. She's actually the oldest orphan in the John Greer home. She gets a letter from an anonymous donor who decides to send her to college. How can this be? Who would take on this uncertainty to educate Jerusha? Who in heaven's name is he? I guess I'll never know. She must write him a letter every month detailing her studies and activities, but she should never expect him to read her letters nor write her back. She assumes that he is an older gentleman and terms him Daddy Longlegs because, of course, she never meets him, so she doesn't know his real name. She only sees his shadow as he's leaving the orphanage. He finds that he's so taken with her letters that he really does want to meet her. I didn't know that she'd be so clever. I never dreamed of such imagination. I never read thoughts so expressive. I really must abstain. Well, maybe one more letter. He's actually her roommate's uncle, so he meets her as Uncle Jervis. And a bit of romance ensues, but of course he's stuck with this secret that he is also Daddy Longlegs. And, well, you have to see the show to see what happens. Drusha really is so optimistic about the world. And one of the things that I love about her too is that she has plenty of faults. It's fascinating to watch her discover them and figure out how to compromise in her life so that she can lead a successful life. One of the benefits of having a rolling world premiere is that we haven't needed to stop creating the show. We've been able to meet all of us with our creative team before each run and talk about things we want to change, things we want to make better, and that's such a gift and truly unusual. We just get to keep making it better and better. Oh.